In today's episode, we'll be doing a complete drive through to take a look at the entire Table Rock Lake State Park Marina, Boat Launch, and Campgrounds. So come along with us and let's see what this property has to offer. This video is brought to you in part by the official RV Camping Journal, the most complete way to record and preserve your family travel adventures. Get your copies today by clicking the link in the description. Thank you for sharing a moment of your time with us. Happy camping! Located one mile south of Table Rock Dam on Highway 165, you'll find Table Rock State Park, Marina, and Campgrounds. Today, we're going to show you a complete drive-through of the entire property as if you were driving through it yourself. When you first enter the property, you'll find the registration station. Across from that is a beautiful play area, a playground, picnic areas, and flushing toilets. Now let's check out the boat launch area. As you can see, there's plenty of parking for cars and vehicles with boat trailers. There's plenty of room to back two to three boats down at a time. Need an extra life jacket or two? Don't worry, they have you covered here. If you like picnicking, this is a perfect spot. Several picnic tables are along this area. Now let's head toward the campground areas. As we approach the first of two campgrounds, Notice how big the spaces are. This is late Sunday afternoon, and speaking to the park ranger, he told me even though the park is pretty empty right now, he said many tourists are coming in for a new stay. This is such a beautiful property. If you're like us, you always wonder what the bathrooms and shower houses look like. So let's get out and take a look at these. Luckily, no one was in here because I forgot to knock. Did you notice that? These are some large restrooms and they're really clean. I was surprised at how clean they really were. 
well, let's walk around, take a look at the showers. These are nice showers, a fresh coat of paint and they would be perfect. Check out how big these spots are. These are huge. Now let's continue on and see what the other side of this first campground looks like. Looks like someone's filling up their water tanks. I hate to drive across water hoses like this. Check out those steps. Those are really cool. One thing I want to point out is how smooth the roads are coming in and how level the spots are. Here's another nice playground for the kids, the young and the young at heart, along with restrooms, showers, and laundry facility, as well as your dump station here on the right. Now let's head over to the other side of the property for the second campground and marina. This property is full of nature trails that go all over the property, as well as a paved trail that's 2.2 miles that follows the lakeshore from the marina to Dewey Short Visitor Center and Table Rock Dam. This property makes you feel like you're far, far away from all the hustle and bustle of Branson, but don't worry, you're less than five minutes away from the strip. Here 
comes a park ranger. Everybody wave and say hi. Now let's take a look of campground number two. On the right, you'll notice some back-end sites or tent primitive sites. Some of these aren't so level. And it's time to release the toad. like this video so far, we would greatly appreciate it if you would give us a thumbs up. That would help out so much. Sometimes when we're driving around and see a sign for another park, we decide to drive in, take a look at it, and admire all the new RVs. You never know what you're going to see. Even though you can't see it here to our left, that is the dump station for campground number two. If you and your family's ever stayed here at Table Rock State Park, we'd love to know your thoughts. Be sure to leave us a comment below. And also, don't forget to give us a thumbs up. We surely appreciate it. This building is equipped with eight individual showers. Let's take a look at one of them. These showers are very roomy. They're well equipped. Now let's check out the laundry room. Looks like somebody's been doing laundry. This is a nice laundry facility. Now how about let's take a look at the restrooms. These are nice restrooms, something you'd feel comfortable using. A 
And here we are, another playground for the young and young at heart. Now let's go take a look at the rest of this campground. If you want to come camping and pitch a tent, but you don't have a tent, don't worry. This campground has two already set up and ready for you to enjoy. Be sure to notice how close you are to the lake shore and the water behind you. Here's a closer look at one of the two tents that they have set up and ready for you to enjoy. Want to spend your vacation in something a little bit different? Check out this shirt. This is a really interesting piece. Now let's head down and check out the marina. The marina rents ski boats to paddle boards and everything in between. So no matter what you're looking for for the day, they've got you covered. This map shows you the 2.2 mile trail that leads along the shorelines of Table Rock Lake. No matter whether you like to walk, jog, run, ride bicycles, or in a wheelchair, this is a perfect trail for anyone and everyone. And there are several trails that will lead you off the paved trail and straight down to the waterfront. Look at this, isn't this a beautiful scene? So there you have it, a complete look at Table Rock State Park, their marina, their campgrounds, and a beautiful look at Table Rock Lake. Oh, one thing I forgot to mention was if you have the National Parks Pass, be sure to show it for a 50% discount at their campground.